Welcome to Adam of our YouTube channel on this product related testing review. We have these from Walkers. Do you remember that other video I did? What was they? Cesara. Oh, I don't know what that was called. There was these, there was these, but these were in the video. These have been in the cupboard about three days. Four, no, about five. These, these have been in the cupboard about five days and no one has touched them. And I did the review of their, the other ones that come with it and these made an appearance in that video. It was about five days ago, I think. No one's had any of them. I wasn't going to review these, I just picked them up for the cupboard. And no one's, no one's had anyone, it's to surprise me, so I'm going to have to review these now. Barbecue pulled pork, brand new, from Walkers. These are their trending tastes. So I'm over these. That no one, no one's, I don't know why no one in my family's eating them. It's, it's a strange one. I can't, I can't figure it out. Let's taste these. I've had this issue before with Walkers. They bring out a new taste. But it just tastes like an old taste. They taste exactly the same. Vaguely the same. We're talking like 99.9% .9 the same as another flavour, which is smoky bacon. These, but If someone handed me them and I was eating them and I didn't look at the pack, I thought I've had smoky bacon. Someone said, what flavour of twisted you just have? Smoky bacon, why is that? But they're saying this is barbecue pulled pork. It's not. It's smoky bacon. If I was reviewing them and there was just smoky bacon, I would say that's a nice smoky bacon crisp. There's nothing wrong with that. It's a nice, it's a four out of five. Smoky bacon crisp, four out of five. Best they're not saying it's smoky bacon. They're saying that's pulled pork. Barbecue pulled pork. Well, because you can pull the wall out of a lot of people's eyes or even over the wall. You can pull, what's that saying? You can pull the wall over a lot of people's eyes, but not my walkers. I review these products for a living. All you've done is just put one more grain of something in the smoky bacon pack of crisps and tried to sell it off as something new. I'm not buying your lies, walkers. Like I say, that's a nice crisp. That's a nice crisp. You can't go wrong with that crisp. But you ain't conning me, walker. One out of five for the lies. Right, so you've made it to the end of that video. Was that crisps? I can't remember. I filmed it a couple of days ago. I'm going to have a break now from YouTube. I'm going to have a break since the start of the year. Since January the 1st, I put up about 60 videos. I'm having a break. I'll come back stronger. So I'm going to have a break for a little while. But thank you all for watching uh, my food reviews. I'm going to try to get some better ideas and come back with something that ain't food reviews. But in the meantime, while I'm on a break, I'm going to buy some new t-shirts. Some new like jumpers. I'm, I'm, this one's quite nice, but I might get it in, I don't know, blue, uh, red, red quite nice. That's not bad. Yeah, or I might just not buy any and just keep the green one. But yeah, thank you very much for watching for the last 60 videos. This channel, we're almost on to about, what we almost thought we were on about 260 subscribers last time I looked. 259, something like that, somewhere around there. It's going quite well because we've only really pushed this channel for the last few months and yeah, the subscribers are picking up. So thank you very much for watching. Enjoy the next 10 days, I think it's on, on the road. We, we ain't giving up this channel. We've got videos for the next 10 days on the bands. That's one every single day for 10 days. I'm just not in none of them. I'll be editing them. But Vincent is on the dance floor. Vincent has stepped up. He's on the dance floor, the boy. I'm taking a back seat. Enjoy Vincent for the next 10 days and I'll see you in April. The vape.